Hello everyone, my name is Excessive, and today we are back on Hypixel Skyblock. So, we did a little bit of a stream yesterday, where we were just grinding zealots. We ended up getting 21 summoning eyes, and some other cool drops like crystal frags and absolute ender pearls. And after all that, and a slight amount of contraband, we have enough money to make a pretty big investment. But before we get into that, I want to talk about today's sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. I wish. We are unfortunately not sponsored by Raid Shadow Legends, but we could be once we become official YouTube partners, which happens at 1,000 subscribers. We're already getting pretty close, so if you haven't already, please consider subscribing to the channel as it helps out a ton. Subscribing to the channel is completely free, takes two seconds, and will also guarantee a handle in your next Floor 7 run. Here we are on the end island, but before we make our huge investment, we're going to make a little smaller one by talking to this guy as we get our tier 5 of Zelluk. So in total, to go from Zelluk 1 to 5, I guess 0 to 5, I think it ran us around 16 million, maybe closer to 20. So it was not very cheap. We're also going to withdraw a slight amount of coins from our bank. We're just going to grab like 50 mil exactly. And we're going to make what chat called a terrible investment, what I call a gamer move, which is going to be buying a legendary Enderman pet. So if you, you're not already aware, the Enderman pets, which apparently jumped up three mil since last night, I should have bought it then. Um, it has the ability called Zealot Madness, which increases your odds to find a special Zealot. So currently at level 41, it is 10.2%, but fully maxed out at level 100, it is 25% more Zealots, plus the 10% from Zealot. So we should be getting a ton more summoning eyes. We might buy one of these other ones. I actually really wanted one that had a tiger plushie already on it, but it's whatever. Like this one, but 65 mil is a scam, so we're not going to be doing that. I think we're just going to buy the cheap one right here for 47 mil. Ooh, there we go. Let's take a look at it. Let's go claim him from the auction house. There he is, our boy. Let's use him. There we go. And now let's go check him out in the inventory. There he is. Let's equip him. In addition to getting extra uh, zealot luck, he also gives some pretty decent stats. Mostly just the crit damage. And then the taking less damage from end monsters will be really good once we start doing E-Man Slayers, which I don't intend to do for a very long time. So now that we have our Zealot maxed out and we have our brand new legendary Enderman pet, we are going to be farming bruises for one hour. And in the previous video when we did this with an Aurora staff and no Zealot and no Enderman pet, I think we made it around 5 million per hour. I am honestly expecting this to be more than triple that. So we're going to find out. We're also using the Juju Shortbow. Wow. Okay. We're not going to count that. Literally two kills and we got a special zealot. It's already happening, man. That will not be counted towards the one hour. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. We're going to farm here for one hour. Record all the drops except that one. And then tally everything up and see how much we'll make. So we just finished farming for one hour. We managed to get 12 summoning eyes, nine crystal fragments, some enchanted blocks, and some ender pearls. So we're gonna grab all of these, we're gonna sell them to the bazaar and see how much we make off them. I realized that my cookie actually ran out, so I have to walk over. Here we go. Bam. This sells for a 12.6. Right now it says 11.5 for the summoning eyes. I wonder if we make a sell offer. It seems like it's about the same, so we're just gonna insta sell everything. 
and then I accidentally already deposited the money we had in the purse. We made like 270,000, almost 300k, just from the gold you get from killing them. So in total, we are pretty close to 13 million, which wasn't quite as high as I was expecting, but it's not bad. And then what I would recommend if you are doing this is A, if you're strong enough, do void glooms along the way. Get your Enderman uh, East Lair bosses. You can get some good drops. In addition to that, you can also flip on the side, which is what I would definitely recommend doing. There's some very easy flips you can do. Probably the flips I would recommend are just any kind of low volume, high price flips. Like one I can give as an example are burrowing spores. They take a while to fill up, but when you do get them, they're 400k profit. So you can do like one at a time. Do buy offer. Bam. And then start farming zealots. Then once it fills up just quickly, if I had the cookie. Um, easy. And then just collect it and flip it again. But overall, I mean, 13 million coins per hour just doing zealots and nothing else. You know, no void glooms, no flipping. It's pretty good, honestly. So overall, I would say it was definitely worth it to get the Zelluck as well as the Enderman pet. And absolute worst case, if we ever do need to get rid of it, we can just sell it. But we'll probably keep it for Enderman Slayer anyway. So I think it's going to be a decent investment no matter what. But yeah, that is going to be it for this video. I do appreciate if you made it this far. If you have not subscribed, please consider doing so as it helps out the channel a ton. Thank you all for watching and I'll catch you all in the next one. Take care.